John Ma knows how dangerous the state's roads are. Struck by a four-wheel drive 25 years ago, he was told he'd never work again. Two and a half years later, his daughter Carmen died after falling asleep at the wheel. That changed my life, my family's life, and the lives of so many of our friends forever. 56 Victorians have died on our roads this year. And while it's a decrease from the 64 killed year on year, there's been a spike in the number of people dying on rural roads. They are a statistic to most people, but they are a family member to a family. They are a friend of somebody. Police say inattentions to blame. When I say drive distraction, I'm talking about your uh, mobile phones and uh, general things that dis distract your attention from your focus on driving. We're being reminded to drive to the conditions and be extra cautious given recent rain. Coming into this time of year, uh, after a long dry spell and you get the wet roads, people got to be aware that uh, the road surface is going to be extra slippery because of all the build-up. With road deaths spiking on long weekends, we're being urged to be extra careful this Easter. The best advice, allow plenty of time and leave early. Leave early when you're going anywhere and then you can take your time. Grace Aiken, Win News.